beloved, you have been practicing the present understanding of what it is that you desire. In these practices, you are allowing yourself to see how you have assigned the body as the owner of you. And you are allowing yourself to slow down long enough to be able to see the machinations of what it is that you are desiring, what it is that you are programming into your consciousness by looking at the actions that are being taken. Beloved, you are looking to see what it is that you want. But now the question that we would like to propose to you is why? Why are you desiring what it is that you are desiring? For when you engage why, you engage an aspect of creation and imagination to understand what it is that the soul is attempting to experience, which is paramount to what it is that the body is allowing itself to experience. One is the driving force and one is the experiential force. So begin to ask yourselves, beloved, why is it that I desire what it is that I desire? What is it that I want to experience? What is it that I have agreed to experience it? What is it that I have said, yes, I volunteer to go and have that experience. This is what I want. This is what I desire. It places you in a position, beloved, it gives you a perspective, shall we say, of being able to understand why it is that you are putting yourself through certain dramas, through certain experiences, through certain relationships, through certain thoughts, through certain beliefs. And this will give you freedom rather than feeling like you are in a stranglehold, rather than feeling that there is no escape. Why am I desiring to experience what it is that I'm experiencing? Enjoy this process, beloved ones. Enjoy and indulge. You will be rather astounded by what you discover in this process. Blessings and love to you always, precious and beloved brothers and sisters. We love you and we will speak with you again.